Hi, I'm Nicole, Nicole Gaston. I am the library manager here at Toy Fakari and the School of Dance. And I ride my bike in Newtown, in town, almost every single day. So I live in Newtown, I work here in Newtown, and I try to ride everywhere and avoid using the car as much as possible. So you always see me around town riding my bike. Um, what do I like about it? I just love cycling. I like the feeling you get passing cars stuck in traffic. I like, I definitely like that feeling. And I also just love that it's cheap. It's probably one of the cheapest ways to get around. And it's good for your health too. You know, like I come up this big hill every day and you know, I get a little bit puffed as I'm coming up it. And I'm like, okay, that's good for my cardio. It's good, it's making my heart stronger. So yeah, so I do that every day. and. I just love, I mean, Wellington is so beautiful too. There's so many places you can ride your bike that are just beautiful to see um, by bike. Better than a car, I would say. So what do I think could be better? Well, I think the cycle lanes we've got are a start, but I would like to see them improved upon and more continuous stretches of bike lanes. So rather than just little chunks here and there, we'd like to see them all connected. and. I think what could also be better is if we got rid of mandatory helmet laws because I think helmets are actually a big barrier to cycling. As, you, as data shows, it increases interactions between vulnerable people and police unnecessarily and it also prevents people from cycling because it's a cost barrier and also it gives drivers the false impression that cyclists are safe and they can drive faster and closer to them. So I'd really like to see us get rid of mandatory helmet laws. I think that would increase the number of cyclists and actually research shows that um, injuries have not actually declined since mandatory helmet laws came in. So uh, that's not a reason to keep mandatory helmet laws. Uh, what else could be better? I think it would just be great to see cars slow down more and treat cyclists with more respect and also not so much anger at cyclists because, you know, climate change is real and we need to do something about it.